We're going to Disney. well welcome back to our channel and we are here at Disneyland Paris in the Cheyenne we have literally just made it in time for our dinner reservation at the steakhouse for 6 p.m. it's 10 to 6 flight was good with EasyJet left I think was it 10 minutes late yeah. so landed a little bit later our transfer private transfer was there as soon as we walked out what was good and um, yeah, we got stuck in a little bit of rush hour, didn't we? So it's taken us a little bit longer to get here, hence why we're now sort of dashing in and dashing out. Happy to be here? Yeah. <laughs> Charlie hasn't been here in how many years? Since six the, years? Since the 25th anniversary. Yeah, so six years, because it's coming to the end of the 30th. So he's excited to go in, see the some Avengers. Models, yeah. yeah, you want to see the Avengers campus. Um, and just see what's, yeah, see what's changed. I was here with the boys in December. There's a whole vlog series on that. So if you want to watch that, there'll be a link at the end of this video to that playlist. But yeah, I'm excited to be here with Charlie. Kids free as well, so we can get on, <laughs> so we can get on the rides. Sitting together for one, but also all the big rides without having to worry that one of us got to stay off with Jude because he's not tall enough to ride. So we're going to be doing all the big coasters this trip. And um, yeah, just enjoy some quality time together. The kids are all fine. I'm charging my phone because that's very low on battery. So I can FaceTime them later. Let's get going. Let's get to the steakhouse. Let's see what the food is like there. And then, yeah, have an evening of fun rides and Disney-fied-esque. <laughs> I just made that word up, obviously. <laughs> so we have just found another door that leads out even closer. So I thought we would have to go through the main door, which is right down there. there. Yeah, but we've just found that door there and that is our room, because we're the second yeah, one in. That is our room. Yeah, so, and as you can see, this is the path. It says Parks and Disney Village. And we go straight down here, what takes us to the river, where we can walk straight into Disney village oh there's another door there but that's for downstairs obviously and then just across the river there you can see the top of santa fe where myself and the boys stayed in december as i've already said but here's the river and now we follow this all the way down underneath the bridge to disney village and we're here within a five minute walk let's go in So we've got some bread and butter and starters have already arrived, which look lovely. Okay, our main 
horses are here, so I've got the ribs, there's lots of there. So Charlie's gonna have some of them nice baked potato, barbecue sauce, and then Charlie's steak, fries, and this little saucepan with his peppercorn sauce in. <laughs> it's cute. And a corn on the cob. So we're gonna sit and eat these. But they look and smell lovely. Okay, desserts are here. And both are massive. And I'm not entirely sure what this is. It looks like a tomato on my chocolate cake. So Charlie's halfway through it. And he's got to this chocolate centre. Yeah, really soft. Bit of a surprise. Yeah, it was. Very soft. My chocolate cake is a little bit dry. But it's not overly sweet and rich. If you put the custard on top, it gives it that sweetness. But it also helps with the dryness. So if it came with nothing else, it wouldn't be as nice as what it is. Okay, we are heading into Disney Park. We seem to be going against all the crowds. As you can see, loads of people are coming out. And we're going in. Well, I don't know, there's a few people going in. So let's we'll see what the wait times are like. We really enjoyed Steakhouse, didn't we? Yeah. It was nice. nice. So for a free course dinner and with a soft drink, it was how much? 79.98. We were on the dining plan, we didn't have to pay out for that. But yeah, we really, really enjoyed it. The only thing you did say was your steak was a bit A bit rubbery, tough. yeah. Um, for a steakhouse place, yeah. the steak could have been a lot better. Yeah, yeah. so... Um, but the ribs were really nice. Yeah my ribs, were, yeah, my ribs were good. They were a little bit spicy, um, but overall, Good really meal. enjoyed it. Yeah, good meal, and it's nice and yeah. Chilled in there. Yeah. As well, so yeah, it was quite busy, but and we did it's, wait a little bit for our server, didn't we, from yeah, time to time? But to be honest, rush. yeah. But to be honest, it was nice and chilled. If we had the children, we would have been like, oh, come on, come on, come on. I think everything is a little bit more rushed with children, isn't it? You don't want to just be sitting and waiting. But where it was just the two of us, it was more relaxed and we didn't mind waiting in between courses yeah. because we were so stuffed so we allowed our food to digest and yeah we're heading into the park look how beautiful it is all the fountains Disney Hotel still isn't open but when it is it's gonna be absolutely amazing so this time we've got the 30th card when I came with the boys it was just a normal magic card so We've actually got the 30th ones to keep. Woo! That's it. <laughs> it's not like a magic band, you know. Let me in. Wow, it looks lovely. Oh, look how pretty the flowers are for spring. Oh, there's a castle. Oh, it is pretty though. I mean, it's stunning. Look at the castle. <laughs> it's one of the loveliest castles. It's so pretty. It's the music. <laughs> huh? Okay, we are heading in to Pirates of the Caribbean. It's a lot darker than it looks on the camera. As of yet, I'm not getting the smell, but as soon as you hit where the water is, I love it. So when we were in Walt Disney World, they call it Pirates of the Caribbean, Caribbean, don't they? And when we walked in, I didn't get that smell. I think it was the aircon. Did you? Yeah. It Keeping is. it cool. Whereas the smell here is from the warmth of the water, isn't it? Let me know down in the comments if you like the smell of Pirates of the Caribbean. So straight on, they've only put a family of four at the front and that's at the back. Whoop. Off we go! Oh. <laughs> Catching Jack smells really nice. Can you smell it? it? Smells good. I do want to eat there one time. Yeah, 
today we're walking up to Big Thunder Mountain we're going to see what the wait time is 25 minutes we're going to check the time on the phone and see how long it does take us <laughs> that girl was having fun it's 22 minutes past so we'll see how long it takes us but it does seem to be moving even up on the platform there this is where the queue starts just here but it is starting to spit so be good to be undercover just in case it gets a little bit heavier so it's quarter two and we're on the platform There you go, it came to me. <laughs> I love the queue line of Phantom Manor and Haunted Mansion. Look at that, the sun hitting it. It's going to be amazing when we get up to the top of the front of the house. The view with the sun coming over. Big Thunder Mountain. Really, really good. It was really good. Yeah, it's fun We can't make up our mind whether or not it's better or the same as, as Florida. As Florida, yeah. Because I went on it in December and I was definitely like it's faster than I remember and longer to be honest whereas in Florida I was like wow that was long yeah. did you get wet? yeah it was oh. oh look at that sun coming through wow through the turnstiles I wonder why they have these here detect how many people go on the ride every day maybe oh wow look at it the sun blaring through there there goes Big Thunder Mountain. Woo! That's where Charlie got wet. And look at the top of the castle. And the sun hitting it. Perhaps you sense a disquieting metamorphosis. Hélas, les choses ne sont pas toujours ce qu'elles paraissent. Tous les contes ne vont pas de femmes heureuses. It appears everyone is doomed at Phantom Manor. Even you? So we've just come out of Frontierland. Everything's all lit up now. Look at the trees. And look at that castle. Wow. Looks amazing. It's so pretty. As you can see, people are already finding spots for the fireworks. Because there's only two of us, we don't have the kids. And we're not too worried about like a Pacific view really, are we? Like when I was here at Christmas with the boys, we came off a buzz and just stood there and it was a lovely view. So I don't want to be sitting out and wasting loads of time just sitting and waiting for the fireworks. Though that castle does look very, very pretty. Into discovery land we go. So we're heading towards hyperspace. I have not rode this in forever. Because last time it was just me and the boys, so we didn't ride it. We'll see how long the queue is. Oh, it's actually in the tunnel, look. Yeah. Is it ready for its blast off moment? I don't know, no one's in it. it. Might not be running. Hyperspace Mountain is down, so Star Tours is five minutes, so we're gonna pop onto this. And then Buzz was saying 20 as well, yeah. wasn't it? So we might jump on that afterwards. Yeah. It is currently 20 past nine. So we still have a bit of time until the fireworks. So just try and get done as much as we can while it's quiet, because we don't know how busy it's gonna be over the weekend because it is bank holiday. Um, for us in the UK, I don't think it is here in France, so um, yeah, we just have to see how busy it does get during the day. But I'd rather do it 
at this time of the night when it's all quiet you don't have to worry <laughs> about all the queues right <laughs> Okay, Star Tours was good. We had a new, new, new story. New story, that's right. So we're going on Buzz Lightyear now because it's dropped to a five minute wait and it was 20 minutes before we headed onto Star Tours. And I won't be filming anything because you're going down. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. I'm rubbish at this right. <laughs> For 30 years, Disneyland Paris has welcomed dreamers of all ages from all around the world. There's something so magical shining from all of our dreams. So now, we invite you to dream bigger, smile wider, and laugh louder. Together, let's make the future brighter than ever. exiting the park we thought we were popping to some shops it's lovely in here and look at this light in the glass stunning yeah it's lovely in here see the uh, Scrooge McDuck there it's nice the Disney train that's the train that they had in the parade oh Taylor I like that one with all the uh, Star, Star Wars, Wars characters, characters. yeah, yeah. there a classic yeah Woody's Roundup 59 euros that's not bad yeah they're nice wow isn't that big Mickey see if Mickey there lovely Main Street's looking a little bit clearer now but yeah we're going to head to the Emporium. We're going to the Emporium. It's going to probably be busy there. Oh wow, look at that all lit up with the pink. That looks amazing, doesn't it? This is the one I'm not very keen on, the tie-dye. There's the bag. Now I was looking at this bag. Let's bring it out. See, I'm not keen on this. I like this, but I'm not, I don't know. This cheapens it a bit, and for 100 euros, it's a lot. We've got some more 30 stuff over here, mug. It's nice. And these little glasses the boys picked these up in December oh I love these Taylor and Freddie have actually got one from the 25th anniversary I feel like we need to get Jude the 30th because the other two have the 25th don't they yeah I know they've grown out of them they're gonna keep them forever aren't they just like as a something yeah keepsake and a reminder what do you think of these ones 
You're not keen? See, I don't like this either. That feels like it's gonna That's peel gonna off. That's gonna peel off after one wash. Ah, there's the spirit jersey that I want. This white one here. The back is just super impressive. Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? I love that. Sixty-five euros. The one that I got from Walt Disney World was an extra small. So I don't know. Might have to look for an extra small. You might have to try it on tomorrow. Yeah, I'm not going to try it on now because I'm damp and wet. Oh, you'll have to put them back up. <laughs> Problems are being small. <laughs> I think I prefer this bag actually. I prefer that bag. To the white one. Yeah. Which, in pictures, I didn't. I preferred the white one to this one, but I just prefer this bit. I just prefer the text on it to the other one. It's not nice, is it? Yeah, it is, and this is all, yeah, this is all embroidered. It's so much nicer. And that's all, like, in the back as well. Look, being, embossed. Yeah, embossed into the bag itself. These ears are nice as well. Chippendale, do you want some Chippendale ears, babe? Yeah, it's nice. You want one for Florida? Well, we, need one for Florida. we do. Oh, you're thinking of taking a Paris bag to Florida? <laughs> yeah, I suppose. How much is that one? It's just got a weird little pocket in the front. 40 euros. And then you got the pocket there, and then the drinks you, one there. Look, it's the weird one there, look. Oh yeah, at the front, and then you do have the big main pocket as well. Yeah. They've got loads of different lanyards, Lightning Queen one. Oh look, yeah, Captain. Captain America. No. No, Captain Marvel. Captain Marvel. Yeah. Yeah. Sure is. yeah. There's a Marvel one there as well. Oh look. Oh my God, you need that for Florida for the Halloween party. I might have to uh, get that. That's nice. I saw this one earlier. I really like that one. And the Stormtrooper. Oh, and they got Darth Vader. So they got three different Star Wars hats. They're all nice. And then this Marvel one. That's really nice. And then the Lightning Queen one. Oh my God, I could buy like all of them for the boys. Like that one for Freddie, that one for Jude, and one of these for Taylor. Oh, look at that one with the little spinny thing on the top. <laughs> That's so nice. And that one is super glittery as well. Lots more ears. Like these ones as well for the boys. They're nice. And do you know what? They're like the ones that I got off of Amazon for like one or two pounds. I wonder how much they are. 17 euros. And I paid a couple of quid for the ones that we got for the boys. Lots of different pens. Oh, wow. Look at the Buzz Lightyear one. Wow, that's heavy. You wouldn't be able to write with that. <laughs> it's quite a way. 30th anniversary ones. Oh. Oh, wow. That feels funny. It's a cat. Yeah, feel it. Yeah. It's like rubbery, isn't it? Oh, it's quite nice. Do you like it? Yeah. You've got a stitch run as well. Bobblehead. <laughs> I've got a red Sally Keyring. Ursula. Nice yeah, they're heavy, aren't they? Lulan. Bell. And then this is the toy section. And you know what? I've got to smell. Oh my god, you were doing exactly the same thing as me. Smell lots so. Oh my god, he smells amazing. It's a shame he's a baddie. Yeah, <laughs> he's a villain. <laughs> Not so bare. And look up there. Stunning again. Really pretty. Oh, more ears. Okay. Oh, it's getting empty now. Empty Main Street. Wow. That is absolutely stunning in the evening. This is the one that has most of like the 30th anniversary things. Like that one. That's the candy store. <laughs> it's all the sweets. Oh, the lollies. 
<laughs> giant bottle of popcorn. Wow. Should buy that and then fill it up with loose change. <laughs> For our next Disney trip. <laughs> Got to eat the popcorn first. Yeah. Oh look, like the McQueen pasta. Munchlings. These are super soft. Oh, they're so nice. Souvenir pots with biscuits and things. Just those book, anyone can cook. What's in, in there? It's just, <laughs> it's just a notepad, it's not really. Yeah, it's not really. There's no, no, cooking, no, no cooking secrets in there. <laughs> you were hoping for a cookbook. <laughs> I bet you that's just another notepad. Oh no, okay, that one's a. Oh, that's a proper cookbook though. Oh, that's good. Oh, it's got that new book smell. Can you smell it as you're yeah. flicking through? Come on, blast that. <laughs> That's cute. Little chef outfit and a little apron as well. Anyone can cook. Sweet. But right, we're going to head in and see what furtive stuff they've got in here or any other Disneyland Paris merch. That's pretty. That's lovely. I really like that. Pink on it. Oh my goodness. That is so sweet. And you shake it and then the crystals go free ting. And it comes with like a lanyard so you can have your phone around your neck. That's really nice. Is that for your phone? Uh, I don't know what phone it's for. Got lots of jewellery in here as well. Oh, lovely. These ones got like the 30th, but it's also a hidden Mickey with Tink. That's really nice. There's another bag. Yeah. That one's nice as well. It's another baseball jacket. That one's nice. I do prefer the 30th one that we saw for the boys though. And they also have, they've got the 30th Mickey ears in as well with the hat. Little bottle holder. Mm. That's good. We used them in America, didn't we? They're just handy. Again, t shirts. There's the spirit jerseys. There's a small again, but I don't think they've got an extra small. Oh, there's more here. Smalls. Lots of smalls. Small, small, medium, small. And there's the hundredth one as well. So they got all the hundredth anniversary ones here as well i really like this one too i just love all the different colors in it and then on the back disneyland paris with all the characters down at the bottom i love that one what do you think of that one nice isn't it i'm not keen on the bag water bottles they're nice what's the lid like oh it's just like a open lid that's dangerous for children. They <laughs> spill the water everywhere, wouldn't they? Nice print. Yeah, it was really nice when I it. Like some decorations over here as well. Another print. I really like that one. Oh yeah, that's nice. That's nice. It's got more than it. Yeah. Oh, I like that one. <laughs> Tink decoration. That's really nice. It's quite thick, isn't it? How would we get that home? Sure. Is it canvas? No, it's just a, it's just a print. That's on just a bulge, isn't it? Bulge, to yeah. it flat. Yeah, but that's your frame. Yeah. So you've yeah, got yeah. a frame around that. Yeah. It's nice. Though. That is nice. It's really nice. Forty euros. That's not bad. Would it go in the case? No, we'd have to buy a bag and just carry it. <laughs> Charlie's trying to work and get it in the case. Got the kids at 100th t shirt. 100 years of wonder, basically. I don't know why I'm saying 100th anniversary. And they got the child size one as well to match the adult one. That's lovely. And we do have the 100th Mickey and Minnie already at home that I ordered off the shop Disney, but they do have a Chip and Dale as well. That's super cute. No goofy though. Or Donald Duck, mm. which would just disappoint Freddie. 
Freddie is a big Donald Duck fan, isn't he? So they do have the 30th Mickey and Minnie in, which I couldn't seem to find when we were here last. So this might be another buy that I have to get. Because they are limited edition. Once it's over, it's over, isn't it? What's a shame. But they've got plenty in here. We'll have to think about it. Because then we have Donald and Daisy from Walt Disney World for the 50th. We'll have Mickey and Minnie for the 30th and Mickey and Minnie for the 100th. So we'll have a good collection, wouldn't we? Right, are we ready to head out, do you think? Yeah. It seems to have died down, a bit. died down now. It's not as busy. But it's lovely just to stay in. No need to rush out and enjoy the Disney magic. Enjoy the Disney magic. The Disney magic is empty. <laughs> As you can see we are back in the room I don't even know what the time is my phone battery died it's got to be about 20 past half past 12 Santa Fe Cheyenne and also um, Sequoia Lodge there should be little machines like you just saw the clip before this one I never saw any in Santa Fe when I was there in December with the boys um, but I saw that you actually get free drinks, number three, free free drinks a day per person. And what you do is you use your card that lets you in your room on the machine and there's like cappuccinos, lattes, hot chocolates. I think there's hot milk, mint tea um, and a couple of other choices on there. But yeah, you get free. Because there's no tea or coffee facilities in your room, you get them. However, you're never told about them. So yeah, just to make you aware of that, if you're coming and staying at any of them free resorts, that you do get hot drinks included in your stay. You've just got to find the machines. But as I said, I didn't see any in Santa Fe when we were there in December when we were given our room key it was put in one of these envelopes and on the back they have the map of the resort as you can see we're in number 11 and there's also little cup logos in each of them to tell you where them machines are so also just keep that in mind when you get your envelope with your keys in I can't remember we were given one of these when we were in Santa Fe, but I can't remember seeing them logos on there because I wasn't aware of it. I can't tell you, but um, they are supposed to be in this resort, Santa Fe and Sequoia Lodge. So, yeah, as I said, if you're staying in any of them, then you do get them included in your stay. So it's nice. Obviously, we've come back from the park just to get a nice hot drink um, and just have something in the morning as well we've actually just met a boy down there getting his and he was in his pajamas um so it's like people don't really care you're going down just to get a drink so i might drink this one pop my jammies on and i might go down and get myself and charlie another one so that we can sit in bed and drink that before going off to sleep but thank you for joining us on this short day in the park and travel day i think tomorrow we're going to start cracking down on our bucket list of the things that we do really want to get done on this trip we both agree it's nice to be in the park late and um, as we don't have the boys with us we can have a slower morning get up go and have a nice relaxed breakfast and head to the park a little bit later and stay in until like midnight every night that probably works out better for us um so we probably will see the show again another night and hopefully fingers crossed we get the drones yeah i'm gonna end this vlog here 
thank you ever so much for watching please do give it a thumbs up if you have enjoyed it and leave me a comment down below because i love hearing from you all and if you're new here then please do hit subscribe because we have lots more vlogs coming your way and i'm sure a haul from this trip as well so yeah we're gonna love you and leave you and we will see you next week but tomorrow for us uh, for another day in disneyland paris bye